All right, so we sell a lot of 48 volt lithium batteries and we have a couple types. The first thing, if you're considering lithium for your golf cart, is cost. Uh, basically, 60 amp hours, and I'll tell you what that means, uh, is about 1750 bucks. Uh, so that's kind of where they start. Uh, you've got two types of options when you're thinking of 48 volt lithium. You got the exact size as the eight volt golf cart batteries, the lead batteries. They're, they're modular, drop and replacement, same size. So they're the easiest to install. And uh, then you've got your mono blocks. So the, the first question, or second question, if you're okay with the price, then is, uh, is your cart stock and or is your cart have an upgraded motor, high amp controller, anything like that? Uh, so we need to know those two things. The reason why is because on the drop-in simple install uh, modular batteries, these are 30 amp hour a piece, and you need two of them. So that's, uh, that's why we say starting out at 60 amp hour. These batteries will discharge roughly 45 amps continuous, and they'll surge to 70. So with two batteries, you get like a 90 amp continuous discharge and about 140 amp surge. The monoblock, the 75 amp hour monoblock, like that's a hundred continuous amps and it's a 200 amp 10 second surge or 15 second surge. And that's good for like, you know, higher output applications. But once you identify uh, what you got, then we kind of recommend um, what, what to go monoblock or to go drop in. Uh, on high amp motors and controllers, typically you need three of the modulars. So that raises your price up a little bit. But 60 amp hours, like for those of you that don't know anything about lithium, 60 amp hours down in southwest Florida gives you like 55 to 60 holes of golf before you're pushing. Um, so that's that's kind of like the distance or range you're getting. Some of the manufacturers will say that's you know between a 24 and 30 mile range, um, but just in, in general, that, that's your distance. That's what you're getting for the 1750 bucks. Um, how long does lithium last? Uh, so basically it boils down to how deep you discharge it. The lesser you discharge it before you recharge it, the longer you get. So for example, um, 2000 cycles. And most lithium batteries are, are tested, at, uh, the cells are tested in a lab for like 2000 cycles, um, at, a, at a, like 100% depth of discharge. And they tell you at the end of that test, it takes a long time, how much capacity the battery has left in it. So for example, if you're doing the 2000 cycle uh, test, okay, taking it down 100%, if you do that once a day, it's gonna take you about five and a half years to do 2000 cycles. Now, if you 2000 cycles, 100% depth of discharge every other day, like you play golf every other day, um, and that's a, that's, that's a lot of driving. I mean, that's, we're saying 100% depth of discharge, so you're doing 55 to 60 holes of golf every single day or every other day. If you did it every other day, it's like 11 years before you hit 2,000 cycles. So that kind of helps you figure out how far your dollars are going to go. Now, are my lithium batteries only good for 2,000 cycles? Uh, no. Basically, a lithium battery typically um, doesn't really matter what brand you get, as long as you get a you know a reputable, high-quality lithium battery, you're going to have about 80% capacity left over after 2,000 cycles. So. If you got 60 amp hour and you're doing 50 to 60 holes for the first 2,000 cycles, after that you'll have about 80% capacity and you'll probably be doing about 45 holes. So it's not like your batteries are bad, you just don't get the range out of them before you need to recharge them. So uh, will lithium make, this is uh, these other questions we get, will lithium make my golf cart go faster? Technically no, but there's a but. And that is because lithium discharges at a higher voltage some people notice the carts are more peppy throughout, you know, throughout the discharging um, of the battery. So some people say, yeah, my cart feels faster. Probably feels faster, might be a placebo, but um, so that's, that's, will they go faster? No. And what is a cycle? Okay, so uh, basically a cycle is a lab test um, where they discharge the battery in a specific temperature, a specific, like a consistent amperage, uh, all the way down, and then sometimes it'll, uh, depending on the test, but a cycle test is based on how deep they drain it, temperature, and how much power they take out of it. And then how, and then they can concurrently recharge it, and then they discharge it again. So it's, it's like 24-7, discharge, recharge, discharge, recharge. And that's how they 
get the data to say that you know the cells are good for 2,000 cycles, and then they know at the end of the test, you know, what capacity the cell still has in it. But um, we do a lot of lithium. These are the 48 volt options. We have 36 volt options too. Chargers, 1750 where you start out. That doesn't include a charger. Some chargers can be programmed uh, depending on how new yours is uh, to work with lithium batteries. If you need to buy a new charger, it's about a $240, $50 bill, just to keep that in mind. So uh, we install them as well.